We begin with new words from local leaders after we learned Rochester Mayor Lovely Warren would resign. The mayor is due to step down no later than December 1st. She released her resignation later letter this morning. Now, those we spoke with today say the move was the right one for her family and the community. Christian Garzone is live now with more. Christian, what can you tell us? Well, Katrina, while some leaders are acknowledging Warren did some very good things for the community, they're also saying she made some mistakes along the way. But there is one common theme today from those we spoke with. It's time to move forward and focus on the issues that still very much plague our community. Reverend Lewis Stewart says he's saddened Mayor Lovely Warren has stepped down. He says during her tenure, she got a lot done. I think Mayor Warren, uh, for the past several years has done a, a great job. But he says mistakes were made regarding the Daniel Prude investigation and 2017 campaign funds. When it comes to the gun charges and endangering the welfare of a child, he says they were political in nature. Stewart says going forward he will support Deputy Mayor Jim Smith and presumptive new mayor Malik Evans. In her resignation letter, the mayor focused on her accomplishments and her faith. The judge of her tenure, she says, will be history. She said the choice to step down was for her daughter and family. Assemblyman Harry Bronson says he's happy the mayor put the families of the city of Rochester first. He called the series of events a sad saga. Uh, I'm hopeful that uh, the next administration uh, can tackle the various issues that our families are facing, uh, you know, poverty, um, the amount of violence in our city. Senator Jeremy Cooney says this decision was the right decision to make for her and her family. Now is a chance to move forward. I'm absolutely committed to working on the issues of childhood poverty, our downtown revitalization. These are issues that require serious and focused leadership. Stewart says at the end of the day, we all make mistakes. The mayor is no different. None of us are perfect. All of us are in need of the righteousness of God. And again, the mayor is due to step down no later than December 1st. Live in Rochester, Christian Garzon, News 8. Jack and Katrina, right back to you.